Thomas Madsen Migdel, what's the state of the net right now in your perspective? I think we're in uh, in an interesting time in, in in terms of the state of the net. Uh, we're in this massive centralization with all these Facebook and Twitter and all these platforms really controlling a lot of stuff. And we've seen a, a big movement the last 10 years towards them. And I so I think a lot of the a lot of the core ideas of the net are a bit challenged at the, at this point. Um, at the same time, I think a lot of the the ideas and the values and the perspectives. Um, of the net um, could be really beneficial to society and to, to reinvent uh, and, and fix all the mess we're in. So it's, it's, it's a time of great opportunity, but also of, of, uh, of, uh, of great uh, uh, kind of uh, turmoil in the energy of the net, I would say. You are an entrepreneur, a serial entrepreneur. Um, the net, as it is, uh, what, kind, what kind of chances it gives a, to a person like you, to an entrepreneur? Is it, is it a good time to start? Uh, a new business or yeah I mean I, I think we live in a time where we need to do new things uh, we, we live in a time where we where it's really difficult for us to understand that we need to create new companies new institutions new organizations um, and I mean we, we live in an amazing time where two 20 year olds in a basement could create the next New York Times that would exist for the next 200 years right the next institution that would deal with deducing all the information in the world and telling the big narrative, the big story. So I mean, the potential to create, the potential to do something of global impact or of local impact is, is greater than ever. Uh, but we need to change our focus to be about uh, not fixing the old institutions, but you know, just letting some of them die and let some new come to come in and, and take the void. And I think as a, so a society and as individuals, we're so focused on how do we fix media companies. We're going to fix media companies by creating a thousand new small entrepreneurs sitting in their basements, uh, blocking away or building social platforms for news or whatever it will be. Uh, you know, it, it's there the innovation is going to come from. It's not going to come from the establishment. That's not their role. Their role is to keep the existing structures in place. So we should let come to an end, what deserves to come to an end. Is there a chance to reinvent uh, other businesses that deserve to be reinvented? I think there's a lot that needs to be reinvent reinvented. So, I mean, I, I don't think you, you can look, I don't think there's any area that doesn't need. You can look around everywhere. And I mean, that is the role of, of, of the people of the net and the people that challenge the status quo, they can see the new. They, they see that something doesn't make sense anymore. They see something that's broken. They see something that's not meaningful. They see something that can be fixed. And then they go in and start doing it, right? Uh, and that is the spirit of the web. That's also the potential of the web and the net. That's the revolution we're living in. It, it's, yeah, I guess revolution or not. I mean, it, it's a continuous evolution, right? But um, we, need, we need to create the new.